What is everything made of? One quiet man dared to answer that. John Dalton was born in 1766 in a small English village called Eaglesfield. He was the son of a poor weaver with little money but big questions. By 10, Dalton was already teaching at a village school. By 12, he ran the school himself. His formal education was minimal, but his curiosity was boundless. He was colourblind and fascinated by it. Dalton was the first to study colour blindness scientifically. It became known as Daltonism, named after him. But colour wasn't the only thing on his mind. He looked deeper, into matter itself. What if all substances were made of invisible building blocks? Dalton introduced the atomic theory, each element made of identical atoms. Atoms combine in fixed ratios to form compounds. Simple, powerful, revolutionary. He even created the first symbols for atoms, like little puzzles. In 1808, he published A New System of Chemical Philosophy. Science would never be the same again. His theory explained the behaviour of gases too. He measured how gases expand with heat and how pressure affects them. Dalton wasn't flashy. No fame, no labs, just chalk and a mind on fire. He suffered strokes later in life, but kept teaching, writing, calculating. When he died in 1844, over 40,000 people came to say goodbye. Today, every chemist owes a debt to the quiet genius who first saw the world in atoms.